Hi, it's Diane and Emily from Three Decades, Three Hi. Kids. We saw the movie the other night and we absolutely loved it. It was so good. We, oh. Thank we, you. We I just love loved it. I know. It's so I'm, cool. I, I want one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get that? In the mail. <laughs> oh, well, lucky you. I want to be on your mailing yeah. list. Uh, <laughs> So, we might know we might know people that can help uh, you. Yeah. Okay, great. Okay. Sorry, <laughs> this is like desperate begging. Can I have some some branded clothing? <laughs> they sent us a little like a countdown calendar to the opening of the movie. So oh, every wow. day we open another compartment and there's another surprise in there. Oh. So this was one of the surprises. Wow. Wow. That's anyway, so cool. speaking of surprises, we were so happy at the movie we laughed we okay. loved like the magic that came through yes. during it and we both got a little sentimental mm -hmm. at Good. one or two parts <laughs> which i wasn't expecting i was mm -hmm. not expecting that and my daughter's like a lot tougher than i am <laughs> and so i wanted to know like were those parts like were they put there on purpose like how like I don't know. It was kind of emotional. I wasn't expecting it to be as emotional as it was. So we really I mean, for, for, for me, the best family movies are the ones where you laugh together at the same things and you you get the same emotional hit at the end. Mm -hmm. I'm never really a fan of those things where you go, here's a scene for the kids. Here's a scene for the grown ups, because I feel the great thing about watching a movie together is you you feel the same things at the same mm -hmm. time. I can't watch the scene where Kayla finds her, her, I don't want to give anything away, her last scene in the movie <laughs> is so <laughs> emotional. Oh my God. I've seen the film like a hundred times and every time I just felt like, <laughs> she's so great. I cried too. I forgot yeah, I was doing okay. the movie. I was just into it. I was so into I I forgot I was even a part of it. I was just like watching it and I was like, oh my gosh, that is so sad. But like so great. It was yeah. so good. Mm -hmm. And then I just I have to ask about the giraffe. Was the giraffe real or was it what no. tell us about the giraffe? It wasn't real. It was a guy holding like a what was like a styrofoam like <laughs> black like head looking thing. But it was it was cool. I liked it. And I was like, <laughs> so I was like, so um, yeah, this will turn into a giraffe at yeah, some point. So I, I know that I know what it would look like. So I was fine. And I got a daughter who was five, just five. So when she was four, she I showed her that scene and she said, and she sort of watched it and didn't really say anything. And then about two days later, she went, Dada, is there a giraffe in your office? <laughs> <laughs> okay, the giraffe works. <laughs> That's good. Definitely. And of course I said yes, because I, I <laughs> Well now now everyone's gonna be asking for a giraffe instead of a pet cat or a pet dog. <laughs> exactly. So you started a new trend. Yeah. Okay. So thank you very much. Thank you, thank you and congratulations. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, so you much. guys.